beautiful peeps of YouTube and welcome. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Kat and you're watching Planning Calm. And here in this channel, I love, love, love to share with you all the ways I can help you plan your way to calm. And in this video, I'm gonna dive right in because I have something very exciting to share. In the process of cleaning up my office and cleaning up my teacher supplies, I found another goodie and I totally forgot I had this. And this is actually a tote that I got from Michael's ages ago. But the good news is they still have it at most Michael's and it is called the Artist Loft Functional Tote. And I'm gonna show you how I turn this regular, uh, run of the mill, very inexpensive tote into my in-house carry all for all my planner, my planners, my planner accessories and all my planner goodies. So if you wanna know how you can make planning functional and cost-effective, something that you can take with you no matter where you are in your house, then keep on watching. You can pick this up right now at Michael's with a 40% coupon for around $3. That's right, $3 folks. You can't get any cheaper than that when it comes to uh, an accessory tote or a planner tote. So I'm going to show you how I fill mine and how I use mine. So here we go. Hobonichi Cousin. So I'm going to put that in there. That is my everyday life planner and I use that for everything. The next is my Hobonichi Weeks. I have my work planner, my Hobonichi work planner and my Hobonichi exercise planner that I keep here. So I'm going to load that up in there like that stickers. I love to decorate with stickers and so I have these cases I got from the Dollar Tree or the Dollar Store and this also is an old passport that I've turned into a sticker holder. So I'm going to take this and I'm actually going to put them up vertically just on the side like that. There you go. And then next I like to have just some notebooks. I'm going to put that in there. Just in between the planners, I use those to jot ideas down and to write things down, etc. And then I have more planner stickers. These are by Happy Planners, and these are my most used sticker books. And I like to keep these on with me at all times, no matter where I am in the house. And so that goes just on the side here like that. And then I have my... Uh, Necessities pouch, this contains scissors, staples, tape, anything I may need while I'm planning or journaling. So that goes in there like that. And then you've seen these before. I have post-it notes, sticky notes, um, some planner decorations and planner accessories. I love these. And they're gonna go in just like that. So this is what I have so far. And then we get down to the nitty gritty. So I love having pens. I like having a variety of pens with me. So I'm gonna put my pens just on the side here, just on the front side pocket like that. And they just fit just nicely there. And then I have some highlighters with me right here. And I'm gonna put my mild liner highlighters just in the front pocket like that. Next, can't plan without my Tombos. Love these markers. Then you're just gonna put these on the side like that. And then these are my dot markers. I got these off of Amazon. They're great. And they have the dot tip. They go on the side there. I have an extra post-it note. I'm just gonna stick that into the front. And some more, I have some eraser, just like some planner accessories. I'm gonna stick that there and one in here, just like that. And then my eraser, I'm just gonna put right there. Then I have just a ring of my washi that I'm using right now. I just like to just drop that in there. And last but not least, I can't plan with dry lips, so I always like to have some lip gloss of sorts, and I just like to put it in the front here. So there you have it. This is my around the house planner caddy that has all of 
my planner supplies in it and it is easy to use, very inexpensive and holds so many goodies. So if you wanna plan your way to calm, get one of these. These are a handy tool, very inexpensive, and it will save you time, frustration, and bring your sanity back to your planning. So thank you so, so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a like. If you liked it, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, and don't forget to share the content with others who may find it useful. So thank you so, so much for watching. Until the next time, take care, be well, and be blessed, my friends, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye, planner peeps.